Hey guys, I know it's been oh so long since I've done a video. I am so sorry about that. I know there's no excuse, but I will at least try to tell you why. Lots of stuff has been going on. Lots of family issues, lots of wedding issues, so blah, just no time for anything, sorry. So I have a product review for you today, one that I have been trying for a very long time, so I know that I like it and I wanted to review it for you guys so that you can kind of um, see for yourself this, if it's something that you would want to try. Um, the products I'm going to be reviewing are the Hair Attrition Shampoo and Conditioner. What's really cool about these is that they're sulfate free. There's a shampoo and a conditioner and they have different kinds but the kind that I got was for the color protect and I don't really know how the other different ones work but I really really loved these how this came about was that I was looking for um, a shampoo and conditioner that was sulfate free because I know that sulfates are really bad for your hair and they just dry it out and especially really bad for blondes so I was just looking for something that you know would be good for my hair and actually be like nutrition for my hair which is what this this line does nutrition for your hair I'll read the back of the shampoo this is what it says on the back you may eat right and exercise daily but just how healthy is your hair it might be lacking essential nutrients it needs to look its best hair attrition delivers vital nutrients your hair requires to be unbelievably manageable silky shiny and radiant sulfate free color protect shampoo with coconut oil sunflower seed extract and UVA UVB protectants extend the life of your hair color up to 66% so what I really like about these are that the outside has the nutrition facts. Like if you had a bottle of pop or something, or soda, however you guys say it, I say pop. It would say the ingredients that are in it. So you know if it's bad for you, pop is bad for you, but whatever. It has all the ingredients that's listing on it. So, I mean, the ones that are important anyway. Of course there's going to be random chemistry things in there that you don't really need to know about. Nutrition facts, I guess, are, it says, exclusive blend of nourishing ingredients, silk amino acids, strengthen from inside out, raspberry extract protects with antioxidants, flaxseed oil adds healthy sheen, and moringa protein reduces breakage, soybean extract repair and repairs and moisturizes vitamins B5, C, e, C and E replenish and condition with coconut oil, sunflower seed extract and UV protectants. So it says all that stuff on the front of the bottle which I think is really helpful because you're like hmm this has this in it and whatever. So it's really nice to know like what is in your shampoo and conditioner. And before I bought these I am I am a, a person that needs to look up things before I buy them. I will not spend my hard-earned money on something without knowing if it's gonna work for me or not. So I looked up a bunch of reviews on this and there's nothing but good reviews and people have actually seen hair growth in a short amount of time using it. So that's probably because of the coconut oil which it in itself is an amazing thing and coconut oil is great for so many purposes but there's so many videos on that so I'm not even going to try. I wanted to, sh to show you guys actually um, what it looks like when after I take a shower and I use this stuff and I'm going to kind of explain to you like how it feels in my hair. Kind of like a first look but I've been using it for so long I know how it feels in my hair and everything but then I'll kind of explain a little bit more about it, how it works, and how it's really worked for me. So, stay tuned. Okay, so I am back, and I am in my very hot pink robe, which looks even hotter on camera. Um, so I just got out of the shower, and I washed my hair with the hair attrition stuff. And 
I seriously, I love feeling it after I take a shower. Of course it's wet, but it's really soft. And like it says on the bottle, it's really manageable. I should say, my hair is pretty hard to manage. It's, um, naturally, it's wavy. And sometimes if I let it air dry, it will get pretty wavy. Like, crazy wavy. <laughs> Which I've learned to like, but... So, um, I'm going to take my brush that... My wet brush that I did a review on. I love this thing. Um, so you can brush through your hair and look at how smoothly it is going through my hair. Literally, I got out of the shower and that was it. I didn't do anything. I just dried it with the towel a little bit. Um, so you can see how easily it is going through my hair like butter. Amazingly, my bangs are always the hardest because, I don't know, it gets extra dry. Um, so you can see how easy it is for me to brush through this. It is pretty crazy. Oh, still really wet. <laughs> Super easy to get through. I'm not pulling very hard at all. I'm just kind of brushing really nicely. Probably not even, it's not even the right part, but eh, whatever. It's okay for this video. So. I'm going to tell you a little bit about how it's like when you use it in the shower. So, first of course I use the shampoo. And you squeeze out, I use a pretty good amount because my hair is pretty long as you can see. And so I use a, quite a bit of product in my hand. I focus a lot on my roots obviously. So I put most of it on my roots and I just kind of... Um, rub it in there. With things that are sulfate free, it does not lather, which a lot of people really hate that about things that are sulfate free because they really miss that that lather because it makes you feel like it's getting clean. But actually it is just stripping your hair of all the nutrients and oils that you need so it's not good for your hair at all. So I live without the lather. <laughs> It does, I mean, it lathers a tiny bit, and which is good enough for me, and I just feel like it's actually getting in there and clean. So when you're putting it in your hair, it's hard to describe. It's not like regular shampoo. It's kind of like you know that there's kind of oils in there. Not like a gross oils, but oils that are getting your hair lots of nutrients and clean at the same time. So it doesn't feel oily, but it, it definitely feels like there's something in there that is making your hair actually feel healthy, I guess. <laughs> and that's a shampoo. So whenever I use other shampoos that have sulfates in them, my hair re feels really dry after. Even in the shower, you can just feel it. It's kind of like, it's not really moisturized. And with this, it feels moisturized afterward. I don't even have to use the conditioner if I don't want to, but I do because I really like the conditioner. After I use the shampoo, I use the conditioner. And I use a pretty good amount of that also. But the key with the conditioner is do not put it in your roots if, if possible. I've learned that the hard way. And another video on YouTube, a lady said that. She said, the only downside is that your scalp can get really oily because there are oils in it. It's like coconut oil. Like if you put coconut oil in your roots, it's gonna be oily. That first time I used it, I did not listen to the lady, which I should have, and I put it on my scalp and I was like, oh, this is really oily and gross and it dried really gross and just icky. Then the next time I tried it, I used just on my ends. Like from from here to to the bottom of my tips, to my ends. I use a fair amount of this and put it in my palm of my hand and it feels moisturized just the second you put it on your hair. It's just like, oh, it feels so good. And I don't know if any of you have ever put coconut oil in your hair, straight up in your hair, which I have. That's what it feels a lot. It feels really moisturized and it's Again, it's like that oily feel, but it's like good oily feel. I don't know how to describe it. You have to try it yourself, but it is just, it 
it makes it feel super moisturized and I really really like that so it actually feels really nice and manageable and when you run your fingers through your hair it it you know really easy to get through your hair which is a big thing I leave it in my hair it says leave on for one minute and rinse well I always like to leave conditioner on longer than it says because I feel like somehow it's maybe getting my hair more moisture but I don't know if that's true I leave it in my hair longer so like shave and do whatever I need to do and then I rinse it out with cold water when you rinse your hair out with cold water it seals in the cuticle I think and tell me if I'm wrong but and it makes it more shiny so I mean look at that shiny really really shiny and when I use regular conditioner it's not that shiny you can obviously tell that it's just like fake plasticky look so I guess my overall feel of it is that I love it I absolutely love it I have not been using any other shampoo or conditioner for a long time I have been using this a straight three months maybe something like that and that's the longest I have ever gone without switching a shampoo and conditioner because I just got bored with it or it just wasn't working well for my hair. So I actually use this every time I take a shower, every time I wash my hair. And I mean, I'll, I'm going to tell you guys, I have noticed a difference in my hair. It's been shinier, healthier, and it has grown. I've got to tell you, it has grown which I think has a lot to do with the coconut oil in it and all the other nutrients and stuff. But it has grown quite a bit. So I have, I trimmed my hair, you know, regularly. And I actually have layers in my hair now because I just was like, ah, oh, I kind of want some more fun stuff to my hair. So I have layers and I've noticed that the shortest layers that I did grew out pretty dang fast. <laughs> And I was like, whoa, okay, so I guess I need to cut my hair again. But I'm not going to cut it again because I really want my really long hair for my wedding so I can have really fun, voluptuous, curly hair. So anyways, the product is amazing. I think all of you should try it. I bought these at Sally Beauty, $7 a piece or something like that. They often have these on sale, I guess, and they actually have the big liter bottles too. This is just... 10 fluid ounces but I mean I've been using this for like three months guys and I'm still pretty good so you don't you don't even have to use a lot every time you take every time you wash your hair I think you guys should all go out and buy it and it is an amazing product and I think you will see a difference in your hair follow the rules though do not put the conditioner on your roots and you'll be golden I think try it and also I have been using regular coconut oil also on my hair. I know, really greasy stuff. I use that stuff afterwards and then I put straight up coconut oil in my hair also just to make it even more moisturized and even more um, ready to grow. That's another really good tip that I have for you guys if you want to keep growing your hair. But my hair is really healthy and you know, I just, I just love it. So I'm really happy with this product and hope that you guys will try it out. I am so sorry that it's been so long since I've done a video. I swear I have good reasons because I'm having my wedding in 43 days. Kind of freaking out. <laughs> so I'm trying to get all that stuff finished. Oh, also if you've been watching my wedding vlogs, I'm sorry I haven't updated it. Again, freaking crazy life took over and I will edit those like this weekend and hopefully get them up this weekend. Please don't unsubscribe to me because I am here, I'm alive, I promise I'm not going to leave you. I'm going to have more videos and more vlogs because once I get married we're going to do all sorts of vlogs. We're going to hopefully vlog maybe some of our wedding. You'll get to see my dress when it's all done and it's almost done, not totally yet. Um, and then you're going to see us moving into our apartment. Noah's actually living there right now, but you'll get to see the transformation of our apartment because right now it is a trash pit just because of Noah's stuff being there. But 
So guys, thank you for watching as always. I love, love, love you guys. Thank you so much for subscribing. And if you're a new person, please subscribe. I promise I am not crazy and that I will put up videos, okay? Love you guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Oh, my hair brush. I need to clean it out. Sorry, guys. That's pretty gross. But you know, your hair comes out. That's just the way it goes.